How you doing? I'm Kevin O'Hara for AlcoholMastery.com. Uh, today I wanted to talk about your past and your future and how they both pale in comparison to your present, the present moment, right? Um, there's no real point in worrying about your past or your future because um, the only time that you've got really to live is now in the, in the present, right? It's the only time you can do anything, it's the only time you can change anything, it's the only time you can think anything, it's the only time you can be alive, right? Past is past. Uh, you know, there's a lot of people get so aggravated and they beat themselves up about stuff that they've done in the past, about things that they've said, about all the amounts of alcohol that they've consumed, the amounts of cigarettes they've consumed, the food that they've consumed so that they've got a, a lard belly now. Um, and all these things are, there's no point in thinking about them in, from that perspective. The only, um, the only possible reason for you ever to think about your past in that way is if you're determined to learn by it, right? If you're looking for the lessons, right? If you're not looking for the lessons, if you're looking to just beat yourself up, or if you're looking to just play the victim card, then, um, you know, if you're looking to play the victim card, it's the best place for you, you know? Because you're gonna find loads of shit in your own past, or you can twist your own past around to your own heart's delight, or your own heart's misery, um, and find a lot of problems there. But if you're looking to um, progress in your life and to make your life better, your past is gonna, it, you know, the only reason to look back is to, to see the lessons that you can learn. Why did I do this, right? What happened when I did this before? It, it led from this to this to this. This is where I am now. And where I am now is because of my past behavior. But I'm in the moment now, so um, this is gonna change, right? Um, they always say that uh, the lessons of history I never learned, right? They're repeated over and over again by fools, by politicians who make the same mistakes over and over and over again because they don't learn from the history of their own culture, right? Their own societies, um, their own countries. Uh, and it's the same thing with personal history. Your future is a similar sort of a thing, right? Future is great to think about, right? And to go, oh, I can't wait till I get there, right? But the future is never guaranteed, right? You're not guaranteed any time in the future, right? You're not guaranteed that when I get down to that bottom of this fucking hill there, that my life won't be snuffed out in a minute by a car coming up and fucking smashing into me, right? And I know that might be gruesome to think about, but it's realistic, right? Something could happen. You know, a meteor could fall outside the sky now and hit me on the head and that's it. My life is over, right? So, um, your own personal future is, is never guaranteed. I mean, the world could fucking blow up tomorrow, for all you know. I mean, what's what's guaranteed about the world being here tomorrow? So, you know, from that perspective, um, I'm not trying to be a doomsayer here, right? You know, these are things, the likelihood of these things happening is slim, but um, the reason I'm saying it to you is because the only time that you've got to do anything is now in this moment, right? The only time you've got to change yourself is now in, in this moment. A lot of people think about the future and they think the person, they're going to change in um, a month's time, say, or two months' time, or they're going to stop in January, as if themselves in January, when they get to that stage, is going to be in a better place to change, to make the changes happen, right? The changes all take discomfort, right? They all take you pushing through and pushing uh, through and pushing through, breaking down those habits bit by bit by bit. Um, and the only time that that's going to happen is now, right? Um, a future you is not going to come along. If you keep putting things off, the future you is actually going to be in a worse position than the present you, right? So the past is the past, right? The future is, hasn't come yet and you're not guaranteed the future. The only time you can make the changes is now in this present moment. If you don't make the changes now, you know, when are you gonna make them, right? The most important thing is what's inside of you, in here and in here, right? You've gotta grit your teeth, set your mind to it, commit to it, and push yourself through regardless of what happens, right? Regardless of the discomfort that you're gonna feel. Commit to it, commit to the process, and do it, start now. There's no point in waiting until tomorrow. Uh, there's no point in wallowing in the past. Start now.
do it now. Take care. Uh, if you want to get the starter pack, there's a few different bits and pieces in there, a couple of books, um, then you can go over to alcoholmastery.com, fill out your name and your email address and I'll send them out to you straight away. Uh, until next time, I'm Kevin O'Hara for alcoholmastery.com. Take good care of yourself, keep the alcohol out of your mouth, onwards and upwards. Take care. Bye-bye now.